What is up, my brothers from another mother? This is Rob coming to you from beautiful Venice Island, leading the salt life, the island life, and 100% the pirate's life. Uh, all work, no play makes Jack a dull boy, as I like to say. And anyway, another great, exciting day to be an XRP holder. Um, I am now 69 days and counting away from the end of Q2. 69 happens to be my lucky number as well, knock on wood, and I'm doing my challenge, which once I'm not, not drinking for the better part of 10 weeks, unless we get a settlement or a summary judgment. Let the champagne flow, my friends, I tell you so. Um, Dark Defender. Dark Defender is calling, uh, had some targets that he painted, and he says that we are through Elliott Wave Theory in uh, Wave 2, which is a correction wave, which will take us down anywhere between, let's call it 38 cents and 42 cents, and hopefully we hold support there, and that will be a higher low. And then from there, the good news, he says, then it is off to chase the next target, which he calls $3. Uh, are you loving three bucks? Comment down below. I'm loving three bucks, especially if we get it soon. I just want to get out of Dollarville. I want to get past two bucks. Three dollars. Now we're talking. Now we're getting, getting stuff going. All right. What else we got? Rumor mill. This gets even juicier. This is floating out today that there might be a settlement today happening. Uh, it is now 7.37. I imagine that we probably have not got it. That did not happen. Because otherwise, my phone would have been blowing up. So, but it was out there floating around that there was some talk and hint that the, the settlement was going to happen today. So, all right. We've waited this long. guess we can wait a little while longer. I am still fired up about yesterday's video really am fired up. I mean, to think that after settlement, we could have a use case finally to let real world utility, and I 100% believe in it, token with uh, a use case value, and that we could see instantly $25 on an XRP. I would faint like you wouldn't believe in that it could be $50, and it could be $100 massive massive so i'm crossing my fingers there are a bunch of doubters out there that say no it's not going to happen this is you know once it settles there's no use case utility value you can throw bc backer in that group he's in that group as well but anyway so i'm still loving that still crossing my fingers i think it's going to happen i really do so i'm i'm still just really excited but you know what ten dollars i'll take my ten dollars absolutely i'll be happy and all the way to the bank with 10 bucks. Give me 10 bucks and I will take some off the table. And by the way, I'll just mention this. This is a really good way to do it is um, whatever you put into any given token, if you decide that you want to um, take out your initial investment and then you're playing with the house's money. So that's one of the things I will be doing uh, along the way is, and I might even do it sooner than later just to have work from a position of strength. And if it goes lower, then you got more money to, to go back into either XRP or another token, right? So, getting down to the end. My fears. I'm still fearful, and I hope, I hope I'm wrong, but I'm still fearful. There are a lot of people that are really good TA people. Uh, even the Dark Defender one, quite frankly, if you look at how he's drawn out his chart and he's talking about a $3 XRP, he's not seeing a dollar seventy until like September and he's not seeing that three bucks until early 2024 and then there's still in a, a number of people in camp that we won't see all-time high like waters above crypto until August of 2024 I don't know the only only thing that will have me really I, I could live with that is uh, automated uh, market makers uh, David Schwartz, hurry up, get that puppy out, and bring us automated market uh, market makers. Because so then at least everybody could start to earn some passive income with their XRP. Hopefully that uh, percentage will be a very handsome one that could be anywhere from eight to fifteen percent, and that would be absolutely.
amazing. I think I might be done with this video. Um, oh, one last thing. This is getting interesting too. In the news today, Coinbase, I'm probably getting low on time. Coinbase, they are leaving the US. Just Coinbase US. And, and actually, that they do not account for a whole lot of volume at all. Uh, very little volume. So the, it's becoming increasingly difficult to off-ramp, on-ramp, to, to buy crypto here in America. And that's what they want. That's 100% what they want. That's their intended plan. And it gets kind of interesting because are they laying the foundation for a flip-the-switch moment? Because one thing that is going to happen, which also is an absolute ton of money is that they, the NASDAQ is supposed to go live this year, not in 2024, this year. And if you look at, you know, tokenization of, of stocks, it's a massive, massive market. I'll talk about that later in another video. I hope everybody has a great blessed day and I'll see you guys in the next one.